little bit. I probably shouldn't zoom in though, because I'm going to make this vertical. All right, so let me bring my mic in here. So it is Thursday night, and I'm going to make an Instagram reel because it's getting real. It's that time of season. So I'm going to use this little froggy. This is a little cocoa frog, and I'm going to pretty much show you how I make my Instagram reels. So firstly, I don't usually take them in landscape mode because Instagram is, is vertical, so I want to turn my iPad vertically. Right, did I do this upside down? No, it's not. It's right side up. Oh, good. I can just see the bottom. Let me adjust this a little bit. There we go. So we can just see the bottom. And if anyone's in chat, I can't see it just yet. It hasn't popped up. Sometimes it's a little bit slow. All right, so let me turn my frog this way. So in here, I'll just show you the layers from scratch. So here's one of the original frogs, cocoa frogs. And here's a sketch. So here's a sketch of that guy. And right now there's no background. There's just the background of the project. So we have our sketch here. And this is the frog. Let me get rid of this sketch. This is the colored version of the frog. So I want to I wanna use the sketch. I want to have the sketch. I want to erase it away. And I want it to reveal the nice cocoa frog. So instead of just having a plain um, beige background, I just added a little, I added some colors to it. So I'll just zoom out so you can see. So I added a little bit of, a little darker at the bottom. I added a little bit of a blue sky here. I added some white right underneath him just to kind of show some levels there. And then what's really cool is I used, um, what brush did I use? I think it's one of the soft pastel brushes. And I use that and I make like a background. I make a, a really light, kind of like a watercolor texture. It gives it a really, really great texture. It looks like paper. And I add that on the top. And I'll just do it so you can see what that looks like over the beige. So here's just the regular beige, and here is the nice little texture. This is what the texture looks like, just alone. And all, all that is is using that that um, that pastel brush. All right, so whoops, whoops, whoops. Okay, so we have our background, we have our frog, we have our little background colors. I think this looks pretty cool. So I'm going to just, let me duplicate this so I can save a copy of it. Oh, let me just lock it. Okay, so now I'm just gonna merge all these layers. So now all we have is this little guy. And we'll keep it, we'll keep the background on. So this is our image, this is our reveal image. One layer right here. We can bring this on the top. And I'll name this reveal image. Because all we need is two layers. That's all we need. So we have our reveal layer here. And now the sketch. I want to bring the sketch above above the reveal layer and I just made a new background so I'm gonna do it I have the plus I bring this beige color drop it in so now I have my background and I have my sketch and I've already like lined them up I've already used the the size tool and I've lined them up already so they're perfectly aligned so now I'm just gonna merge these So now we have two layers. This is the erase. Erase is good. 
So we have our erase layer, and when it erases, it's just going to reveal this underneath it. Okay, so that's the that's that's the technical part. I think it looks pretty good. So now for the eraser, I'm going to use I usually use Blackburn. Maybe I should find a different brush to use this time. But Blackburn it looks pretty cool. So that's going to be the reveal. Uh, I would zoom in, but Pretty fun stuff, so it's a nice cool reveal. You can make it dramatic. Obviously, you're gonna add music and things like that in Instagram. But let's play around with some other brushes. Let's see, let me zoom in. I'll zoom in for now. Jen. I was thinking about doing the graffiti, but um I don't know if I'm going to do the graffiti because I'm a little tired. And I think I have to work, but I don't know what time I have to work in the morning. So I'm just doing an Instagram reveal, but I am going to get back to the... See, now, see now, now, Jin, now I feel like I need to go back to the, the, uh, the graffiti. But I got to do this reel because I got to start making some Instagram reels. And I haven't had a chance to today. So I figured I'd go live with my little froggy. So let me see what's what what might be a nice a nice brush a nice erase usually the these spray paints are a bit weird yeah that's a bit weird although it looks kind of cool really it's cool as a texture elements smoke that's kind of strange and the thing is with the erases is you want it to erase thoroughly, otherwise it'll so you'll spend too much time on the uh, on the erasing. Stick man, that's crazy. It's kind of interesting actually. Like it kind of looks like it's like animated. I actually kind of like that. That's pretty cool. I like Stickman. Okay, so we'll, we'll go. We'll go with Stickman. I've never used this brush before. I've actually never even heard of it. Uh, I'm gonna use my. Should I use my old phone? I'll use my old phone. Maybe I should use my new phone. All right, so I'm gonna use my new phone here. I'll tell you what. I'll do a little bit of the. I'll do a little bit of the graffiti thing. Just because now I'm all excited about it again. Alright, so I'm going to use my phone to take this. Uh, uh, should I just do it in Instagram or should I do it in... No, I'll take a video of it. So let, me lock, let me zoom back out here. What's going on, Jen? What are you creating? I don't know where do you live what do you well not where do you live but like where are you from what are you creating what's what's going on what time is it where you live since you're my only person that's up at midnight i'm in brooklyn so it's midnight here okay so when i usually make instagram reels i take the video with my phone because if i need to i can edit that video a lot easier i think with like cap cut cap cut's a really cool app um, but I just feel like I have more control using the camera in my phone. Uh, I just have a, 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 I just have more options. So I'm probably gonna like zoom in to like the eye. But I gotta make sure that it's in focus. So, so probably zoom in to the eye. I'll do a little practice. Then do stick man. And bring the sticks around. I 
think I like when I... I'm actually touching my... my phone with my hand. The only thing is I want to... I want to do the whole... I want to do the whole page. But that would be too big. So I think... This is kind of cool. Actually, does that get... I, th I felt like it was a little... Um, there might be a little... Uh, what's the word? Then maybe I'll just switch, and then maybe I'll just do like... Okay, so I like the first one. Sticky, what's up? Sticky like frog's feet. Okay, so I think I'm going to... I like to start back. Really far back. Oh good, you can see me in this camera. I'm going to start really far back and then I'm going to... Oh, I got to go to video. I forgot I gotta go to video. Okay. Video. I'll go here. I'll start really high. And then I'll swoop in. And I'll start. Oh, I have the big thing. I want the brush to be smaller when I start. Dang it. the brush to be smaller yeah like that I hate when I do that I get so excited I get ready to take the video and then I have the wrong brush size that's okay so let's start again so I'll go from way up here we'll start and then we'll swoop in I think I'll stop it there. I'm gonna post it on TikTok and Instagram Reels and Reels. Um, Cause Reels, I can make some money off of Reels on, on Instagram. So I usually don't make that many of them because they don't really go that well on my grid. Like they're a little, like I like to have my grid very clean and just have the beige animals. And sometimes the TikTok, sometimes Reels kind of uh, doesn't really go with that aesthetic, but you can make some money with Reels. So it's time to make some Reels and TikTok. But TikTok, I don't know. I don't really have a, I don't really have a decent audience on TikTok. People on TikTok aren't really interested in my art for some reason. But it's just weird. That's kind of how the, that's kind of how the social media works. Like you kind of have to fit in, get in where you fit in. You know? Okay, so now let's do uh let's do something random. Let's, let me zoom this in and then I'll I'll make this big. 
I'm gonna zoom this out. So we'll stop that. And then I think he just needs a nice clean pass. Something to kind of show like the whole thing. So maybe we'll do one of these. Uh, maybe I'll start from the butt. You make money on tick how do you how do you make money on TikTok? Tell me the ways. I gotta figure out how to make money on TikTok. I don't know. I don't know how to grow my audience on TikTok, but I feel like TikTok is more like real people doing real things, real funny skits, stuff like that. I don't know. But also I feel like I don't know. I'm kinda old for TikTok, I feel like. So we'll start here at his butt, maybe, and we'll just and we'll just scroll out and kind of like maybe I'll add this in, so you guys will be in my Instagram. Maybe that's weird. No, I don't want to like. What can I do? What should I? Should I just like. So I'll smile. Okay, so we got a little extra. Zixothy. Thanks so much. I appreciate you. You signed up for the partnership? Sticky. Sticky. That's bomb. So you must have like a decent audience on there. I only have like I only have like 3000 likes like through the through the life of my TikTok. I have nothing. I love to draw using iPad, also using Procreate. That's why I love to watch videos. Well, thank you. That's cool. And you know what? It, it's, it's funny because it actually motivates me too. All of this stuff motivates me too. Uh, even when I just want to like go to bed, sometimes I'm just like, oh, I just want to just go to bed and not do anything. But I'm like, I got to go on. Oh, sticky. That's too much. That's too much. Are we, fr are we, f well, I guess you probably, it's probably hard to, hard to keep track of keep track of that but i'll search sticky on tiktok so i can see i can see what you're putting out on there that's 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 a that's another level that's another level sticky okay so back to my uh back to my peasant instagram reel here okay so let's see what we can do in instagram so i don't uh what's the best way to do this i wish i could just like Oh, that's right. This stupid thing is now going to be in the in the shot, though. Hmm, what's the best way to do this so that you guys can see my screen? First of all, let me raise it up so it's brighter. Let me turn off extra dim. Oh, it is off. Oh, the night light is on. I forgot I have that after midnight, the night light turns on. I gotta turn off this dang autofocus. Okay, I think that's actually pretty good. 
Well, my room's dark because, um, well, first of all, it's a mess. And then second of all, I mean, now it's a little bit brighter, but it's just, it's nighttime, so it's dark. And I don't have that many lights. I got to put another light back there, but my room is not like, my room isn't geared for like to view behind me in this direction. That's why I never really use these cameras. But now that I do the live streams, I'm like, why not? So let's see what I can do with this reel here in Instagram. So, oh, I gotta go to reels. I actually should edit this in, um, in uh, CapCut, but that's okay. CapCut actually is a bit easier to edit stuff like this. So I'll add. Look at this. I'll add, um, oh, can I add all of these? I'll make my life easier. I hope it's not gonna like try to make the video for me. Let me skip this. Just add the videos. You probably can't even read that. It's like processing something. I don't know what it's processing. I think I made a grave error. Cause I don't know what it's doing now. Okay. Do we have all our videos there? Okay, so we have that. Oh, that was the mistake. That was the mistake. So let me edit these. This one I can delete. Done. Let's preview what we have. The heck was that? Uh, wait, this video is like 24 seconds. I'm so confused. Okay, what's happening here? Oh, I, I think I know what's happening. Okay, so I need to clear timer. Right, I'm gonna delete everything and start over. I should probably be asking Sticky how to make a good video. I thought I could make I thought I could make a TikTok for like I thought I could make a TikTok I mean a an Instagram reel that was longer than sixty seconds. Oh maybe that's TikTok. Maybe that's only TikTok. Yeah, I think that's TikTok that I can do that. Okay, so we'll edit this and we'll see we'll see what we want here. So it probably doesn't need, that's a little boring. It gets a little boring after a while. So, let's see if I can trim this. Why can't I trim the back end? There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna add that. I, yeah, I do get comments about uh, this stuff, but I, 
um, I'm getting a new computer and probably, I don't know if I'm going to get a new phone or get a new camera, I don't know, but I make do with the equipment I have for right now. Um, I would love to just be able to just buy all the, the best stuff, but I have like a 2014 computer. So this is all I have to work with at the moment. Um, but hint of Jasmine, what's up? How you doing? Coming through. Coming through the other side to see what's going on. These these lives have been like, I know the quality isn't great, which I'm I keep getting reminded of, but um, they're very fun, and they're very motivational. I I must I must say. And I've I've come to love doing them. Even when I'm tired and I want to go to sleep, I'm like, well, let me just go on live, and just have some fun. Oh, actually, are you doing live stuff? I I wouldn't be surprised. I'm trying to think if you. I know you do the. I know you did the. Um, the space camp thing, the art camp, space camp, but I don't know if that was live or not. Okay, I'm getting sidetracked here. Okay, so let me let me crop this. Crop that about there. I'll add that. Yes, exactly. Like literally, just making do with the equipment I have, which I know isn't the best, but like this computer's from 2014. I'm using an iPhone, my fiance's old iPhone 5, I think, to record. Um, and yeah, so, you know. I know it's crappy, but there's, you know, what can you do sometimes? So, okay, where was I? Where was I? I did this one, I did this one. Okay, why is this turned this way? Can I not change this in... Oh god, that's so that's so weird. Okay, so that's not really that useful. So I guess I have to change the video. So edit this. I'm using a um, Pixel Six, by the way, just in case anyone was wondering. I think it's crop. There we go. So I'll save that. Ruby do hello. Yeah, I've been trying to do them a lot. I've been trying to do them every night around eleven o'clock. As long as I'm not working, I've been trying to. Uh, I've been trying to go live. They're usually probably a lot more streamlined than this. Um, this is kind of just. I always kind of. I always want them to be quick. Because I want to be online for like an hour, but croquet camp for kids. Oh, it's pre-recorded. Okay. It's actually, oh my God, it's actually a lot easier. Going live is a lot easier because you don't have to. So I want to add, which one do I want to add? Where was I? This one, this one. Oh, this is the one that I made. Okay. Really? That's what it's going to look like? What's up with that? It looks fine in the preview. And it looks fine here. Hmm. Um, okay, so I don't think this is going to work. Why, why did I just go to YouTube? I don't know. Get sidetracked. Get too excited doing these things. I don't really know. Okay, well, you know what? That isn't working. That's okay. We have all of our frog. Let's just go back into Instagram. And record a little bit more. But first I got to get 
First I have to get off the selfie cam because I hate when you go to the camera and it's pointing at yourself. It's so embarrassing. All right, so let's switch this. And we'll, yeah, we'll do a little reveal from really, really close. We'll try that. So do I have to just press it? Actually, no. You know what I want to do? I don't want to do that. Let me delete that. Because I want to go all, I want to go really, really high with it. So I'll start really, really close. Then I'll zoom out. So we see our frog. Then I'll zoom all the way out. So then I zoomed all the way out. And now I'm going to add this last silly frame of me being silly. I think I'll add that. This is the weirdest. This is the weirdest. Usually, I, usually I make them. Usually, they're a lot uh, smoother than this, and they don't involve all this extra stuff. But I don't know. I like extra stuff. Like I'm like I want to add something else to it. Maybe I'll add. Um, I'll add the rest of the frogs. Just because I have a little time left. So. so I'll add one. I'll add this guy. I'll add this guy. I'm gonna have to get rid of my voice. It's terrible. It's the selfie game is terrible. I will agree. Ruby Do. I I love I love that I love that name. People have the most creative names. I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, I can't play music though. All right, so I think, so I can't play any music, so I can't figure out what music I want yet. I'll have to do the music later. So I will just, can I save this? Let me just see if I can save it. Um, Save draft. Better save exactly the way I recorded it too, or else I'm gonna be upset. How do you say that? Dis Disney, Disney, Disney. What's up? I've been doing lot. Yeah, I've been doing lives every night, and they actually do fairly well on my YouTube channel also which i didn't expect and especially because my quality is subpar but still uh they do quite well so which i'm very happy about um again and like i say in my videos i'm hoping to get a new computer i was doodling this earlier today it's fun drawing bears oh wait i gotta my focus is all messed up Again, I have to focus on a, on a, oops, iPhone 5. But if I get a new computer, I don't know if I'll be able to afford, maybe, maybe Black Friday, they'll also have like sales on phones, on iPhones. I mean, I like my, I like my Pixel, but for like recording and sending it to my, my MacBook Pro, I mean my MacBook Air. Or whatever computer I'm gonna have on Black Friday. Hopefully, I'll have a, I'll get a nice computer. I don't know those 2021 MacBook Pros. God, my wallet's gonna hurt. But just like Destiny, okay, I figured. So overhead, I'm using a uh, 
overhead I'm using an iPhone an iPhone 5 so so here's my light so here's my computer here's my light and I have this stuff because at night this thing is like really bright this little blue light so I I just cover it first I was covering it with an earplug and then I had to cover it with something bigger because it was just too bright um, oh what was I supposed to be doing oh yeah so up here is the iPhone so I'm just using an iPhone essentially and I have the wire you know it's just connected to power and it's just up here on the thing on the little thingy me jig and then I have my little uh, uh, microphone a little mic here and then here's my desk and here's everything my little setup I guess that looks decent okay um, but and this is this was the live that I did last night and I feel like I'm a little I don't know if I want to get back into it I think I'll get back into it tomorrow um, tomorrow or this weekend because if I start then it's just gonna get a little um, it's gonna go, uh, I'll just be up for like way too late I think but let me see if I have anything else exciting I can show you on here that I didn't show already. Um, oh, this is some 3D stuff that I made. Uh, practicing coloring in 3D. So I made this in the 3D. I made this in, in Nomad. And then I colored it. I've been coloring it in Procreate. So that's been kind of fun. These are my pancakes that I'm in love with, that I made also in Nomad Paint. Oh, well this lighting, this lighting is bootleg. My other, my other light is better. So this is my other setup. I'll show you the, the talking head setup. This is way too close. My tangle of, my bevy of wires. Oh, I don't really know how to do this. Turn my my room is a mess. So that's my ring light, and this is my nicer camera. That's my Sony ZV1. So when I'm recording with this, let's see if it comes on. Oh, it did come on. I don't think I can get any closer with this camera. Fortunately, I can't. But yeah, so that's like that's what I use when I do like the talking heads. It's like my my good camera. And unfortunately, I'm not able to hook that camera up to up to this computer. For some reason, like I tried, try, but I wasn't able to do it, so I had to use these two crappy cameras. There we go. So I have to use these two crappy cameras, unfortunately. Nomad, yeah, oh my god, like it's such a good app, and it's so, like the, the thing that really puts Nomad over the edge is that one guy, this guy Stefane, I think his name is, who does it, and he cares like so much about it, like he's on all the social medias, people have problems with things, he's like, okay, like, I'm gonna try to change it, or like, that's really difficult, I'll see what I can do, I'll try to change it, and he'll just change it up, and then the next day there'll be like an update. With like anything you need surfix with like it's really really cool and so see if you want to dabble in 3d uh it's really really it's really really awesome uh these were from the blueberry thing that i made in nomad uh it just as a beginner tutorial because uh nomad is very 3d is very um very intimidating like it's very intimidating to think about 3d and to get in 3d so I just did a very general beginner tutorial that anyone could do, uh, follow along with, especially if they use Procreate. Um, 
Um, and here are the pancakes. You know, you knew I was going to show the pancakes again. So here are the pancakes, and then I made some blueberries, but I didn't record the blueberries. So, so I didn't record the blueberries. So I decided to uh, just make a tutorial making them. <laughs> See, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Um, but trust, I'm working. Like, I'm I'm seriously trying to make moves so that I can get at least 720p. I mean, when I get a new, when I get the new equipment, I should be able to go better than that with streaming. I tried Nomad, but for oh, second gen iPad Pro. You know, I use it on I use it on the first gen. Like, I had the I have. The first generation iPad here, and that's what I first started on Nomad with. So it can handle a decent amount of a decent amount of 3D work. Let me show you my blueberries. Um, open. Yeah. So these are the these are the. Uh, I thought there was another blueberry. Oh yeah, there it is. So these were like, this is what I did in the tutorial. I just made blueberries. Um, and I probably will make a few more and just do some other fruit because fruit is kind of, uh, it's kind of simple. But since you were mentioning Nomad, here, here we are with my first, my first gen iPad Pro that like, I've had forever and I, I take very good care of it. I take very good care of all my equipment because I never want to throw anything away. So now I travel with this iPad and I do artwork when I travel. So Nomad. Okay, great. What thumbnails am I missing? That's weird, I've never seen that before. This is so strange. Let me close some of these windows, maybe. I've never had an issue with Nomad until now. This is very, very odd. Oh, maybe because it was already open, I guess? But I made this in, in Nomad. This is my little um, hummingbird. Lots of colors. Colored this in Nomad too. But this is all on, on you know, first gen iPad. And actually, and I'm not a, you know, I'm, I'm not really that well versed in 3d so it was kind of fun to just kind of just figure out how to make these shapes and things like that let's see what else i got here uh open load okay so i'm going to show you this is a little scary uh so i tried to do my little character horus and he went through a lot of changes so this was the this is what he looked like first Oh yeah, it was terrible. Forger was terrible. Forger, Forger was uh, not. That was that was a that was a crappy workaround, and that luckily that only lasted like two days. Oh, let me load. So this is really scary. It's actually quite terrifying. Look how terrifying this is. He doesn't even have arms. Like this is something out of like. Uh, uh, was it Five Nights at Freddy's? What is it? Last night at Five Nights at Freddy's? Five something at Freddy's? Come on, somebody knows it. Five Nights at Freddy's? I think that's it. But that's what this really reminds me of. Because this is absolutely terrifying. So this was me trying to figure out how to, you know, how to make shapes and how to like, 
kind of mesh them together and trying to get what I want. Aeol! Yeah. <laughs> seriously, seriously, disaster. I should make everything big so it's easier to see. But I'll show you some... I, I, I kept working at him because I knew that he was scary. So I kept working at him. And this was like a little bit later on when I kind of liked it. I was kind of like, okay, he's sort of getting a lot better now. I made this chubby little body. Oh, actually, this is this is probably the final one. But I don't know why the lighting is so weird. So this was like a little further on when he's a lot cuter. Five Nights at Freddy's, Ruby Doo coming through. Let me, and this is the last one. Load. Oh, I keep forgetting to hit load. Okay, so this is the last one. This is when I feel like. Let me give him a little. I gotta give him a turntable. He needs a turntable. It's kind of tricky with this stupid. Wait, let's see if I can catch it. Come on. There's a weird thing you have to do. You can kind of like tap. There we go. You gotta like, you gotta like tap to get to the center. And like center it. It's really weird. Well, anyway, so this is the little guy who I'm finally like cute with. He was he was terribly frumpy. It was bad. It was really really bad. Okay, let's stop this. But he came through, and you know, I just kind of like, you know, I with I thought of like dolls, and I thought of like, okay, let me do the legs and things, uh, you know, like kind of like how a doll would be. So I just did all the legs separate, did the arms separate, the fingers are just like little little chubby little uh, spheres, and you know, just finding ways to get what I needed to get. There's still a lot of problems, like it was really hard to to really get the space inside the model, things like that. But all in all, you know, I'm happy with I'm happy with what I what I came up with. Uh, this is my very first. Let's see what my very first one was. This was my first sculpt. So this is the first thing that I ever made. I was messing around with the eyes and I wanted to make a snail. So I just kind of made this funny looking snail here. He's really mushy looking, but I'm quite happy with him for like my first 3D thing. Pretty happy. But anyway, it's 12.38. Let's see, did they email me back? No, they didn't email me back. I want to know what time I'm working tomorrow. These people are crazy. They got me working, they don't even tell me what time. So I'm just going to go to sleep. <sighs> Alright y'all, I'm going to get going so I can get some sleep. Take these contacts out and get to bed. But um, I appreciate all you guys coming through. And uh, my chat's a little slow, so... You sometimes usually when I sign off, like I get like 10 chats that come through right when I sign off. But I appreciate all you guys, Jin, Sticky, Sticky, who, by the way, I just learned is actually famous. Sticky is famous. Um, Zick Sarthi, Jose Oliver. Oh, what's up? I, didn't, I, I think I missed that. Coming through from Nebraska. Sorry, I missed that. Uh, I try to keep up with the chats, but I missed that one. Uh, Hint of Jasmine coming through. Oh, MC. I missed that too. MC coming through. Um, making do with the equipment I have. Yeah. Yeah. Ruby Do. I love that name. Destiny coming through. I really appreciate you guys. I don't want to miss anyone. Surfix. Yeah, you could probably do a lot on the second on the second gen iPad because I did a lot on the first. Like I I pretty much pushed it. But then again, I I don't use I didn't use the iPad for much more than Procreate and Nomad, and that's it. 
Aeol. Thank you, Aeol. Have a good night, Hands of Jasmine. Have a good night. Haim. Haim. Zen Men. Dorit. Dorit from Israel. Uh, good night from Brooklyn all the way to Israel and everyone else. Have a great night or a great day. And keep drawing. Keep motivating other people. Um, and keep coming through to check out my live streams because I have some more fun stuff and silly stuff. And you guys can ask me questions. And this has become uh, one of the best parts of uh, my night and my days is doing these live videos. So until next time, keep drawing. And I will see you in the next video. Dorit, hi. Um, come through in the next one, Dorit, and we'll chat. We'll definitely chat.